Welcome back guys, CryptoFolio channel. Today we would like to talk about a reef and the Binance announcement about the delisting of that token. Let's dive in. I can confirm basically the main idea, the main uh, bull run plan for that token invalidated because I don't think so. This coin will recover uh, even to, I don't know, maybe 0.208 or 1 cent. So just in case, uh, unfortunately, because after the leasing on Binance, uh, so rarely some tokens uh, perform pretty well. Yes, this token still, still on uh, Gate.io, on uh, HTX, on KuCoin, on Max, on the BitGet, you know, and everything like it's okay. This coin dump uh, like 40% uh, in one day. And this is one great example uh, how the market can be manipulative uh, here the list on a binance was in december uh, 2020 we're not count that week you know so of course the moon boys waiting the 30 cents or so uh, they don't pay attention for uh, circulation supply but take a look they pumped that token in march 2021 to uh, like almost six cents and i would like to remind you the funds and the bakers the binance labs it was on a binance lounge so what's the point uh, for me it's always the just a Confirmation, everything, what we see on the market is just a pure speculation and manipulation because everything what a pro uh, projects, everything what a centralized exchanges can uh, promise you and uh, shill you in their roadmaps, in their fundamentals, you know, on their Twitter, on social media, on the AMA sessions, uh, all this conference, it's absolutely no make sense. Just guys, no make sense because here, this is Binance Labs, Binance Lounge Pool. Uh, everything okay, cool bakers. Take a look. This was Alameda Research also invested in that one, right? Kinetic Capital. So everything good, right? And they invested in that token and they just pump and dump. So what's the point of that project? Like uh, they call it the layer one, right? They, they launch even the, that one, they launched the, even the Tasnet previously. So everything looks okay with that project, but uh, Binance delisted. And technically, of course, everything looks good for, for Reef, right? But uh, this is an example. So all that uh, things about the fundamental, what the people talk, you have to do your own research about fundamental. Fundamental almost doesn't matter because uh, everything with project can be good. And then just the uh, uh, price can looks like this one. And when everybody think and i am uh, also uh we hit and sweep the listing price low low historical low low we should recover back the binance just made an announcement about the listing so it's kind of weird right and uh, maybe this coin will never uh, recover back for me personally it's really really weird what's the point of that for the matter if uh, just uh, one the listing uh from uh, one exchange can affect the price like 40% in one day down and probably this coin maybe will never recover back. I hope, I hope of course that this coin recover back and um, people will not lose their money. But guys, it's just one more reminder. So just be careful on this uh, market. Why I uh, uh, draw that uh, percentage here? Uh, because also oh, weird. So the no, no, no announcement, nothing here about the Binance delisting right on uh, their uh, Twitter. So just kind of weird, right? So yes, of course, before before they talk and I I, I even um, personally tag them and ask what's going on with the monitoring tag? And they answer, uh, we, we're in contact uh, with Binance, everything will be good. Probably nothing good, right? I would like to show you how the coins um, uh, perform uh, after announcement and before announcement. So take a look at the doc and the polls. So just example, so the, here, the announcement about uh, the Binance will delist the bond doc MDX polls. Polka Starter also was good project, normal. So uh, the listing in uh, June, some, uh, June 22, right? Announcement was uh, here, two weeks uh, before, 8 uh, June. Take a look how the polls perform. So this is an announcement, candle down announcement. Then one, two, three, four, five, five days, 63%. Also a, gr a great example, uh, how the market makers manipulate the price. So what's the point to pump the token, which is going to be delisted from that major exchange? Pump uh, 63%. And then the listing and dump again. Doc, even, even better. 
here dump that data uh, announcement of the listing recover back in the one two three four five days almost 200 percent on a spot imagine somebody made a good gains right uh, uh, how is it even possible just because the people uh just not um, pay attention for that announcement so the people see the chart they skip the announcement they just uh, see the coin pump it they hop in and then wow this token delisted where's my coin so if if uh, the history repeat it will the same like with the dog and the uh, polls uh, here uh, 60 like 63 percent it can be the test of the listing price 0 0.2012 and 5 and uh, let's say like like this one fulfill this one daily gap uh, 0 0.202 so just in case it's just uh hypothetical things guys it's not it's it's not it should be a plane like this one for sure no just uh, what happened with the doc in the next five days so maybe maybe the reef recover back before the leasing so we can't know right uh that's why guys i highly recommend you not build a, any any crazy expectation for any single coin because uh you can see how the one uh, the listing from one major exchanges can affect the price of course of course the monero recover back pretty good yes but uh, we can't compare the uh, reef uh, community and the reef uh, followers uh, supporters uh, the holders and the monero so it's totally two different projects so just in case uh, i think yes i think some pump uh, we can see uh, for reef uh, in next a few days and then dump again but uh, also uh, I recommend it to withdraw withdraw uh, your reef to some other exchange or better of course uh, withdraw to wallet so guys I highly recommend you uh, not skip the post and track all updates if you would like to trade uh, with my I hope you like this video write please in the comment what do you think and we'll see next for the reef are this coin recover back or there's going to be the dead coin Subscribe channel, hit the like button, hit the notification button. Don't forget to join my Telegram channel. See you next time, guys.